Hey Tooled Friends, out here with my 2019 Road King Special and we're at beautiful Lake Compesca, turn and blind you a little bit. But today I wanted to go through and show you some new parts I put on this bike. TCMT Moto was kind enough to hook me up with a couple rear lights. So these are for, I know they fit on some of the newer touring the older touring you may need to check to make sure everything works. I got them where the sun is shining on them right now. I thought that's going to be the best way to review this. You're going to kind of see this in real time as I do this. So without further ado, let's light the back of this bike up. So there's with the running lights. We'll apply a little bit of brake right indicator left indicator and let's go back and look what the camera I have attached to me so as you can see even in the direct sunlight you can see that this bike lights up very well I didn't feel there was a lot of visibility, so I wanted to add a little bit of light to the bike. But we're going to go park over here in the shade, and I'm going to show you how they light up a little bit more with, with some shade. And while I ride over there, we'll talk a little bit about the install of them. So one thing I'd like to mention is TCMT Moto is not paying me to give this review. They did send me these lights free of charge to put on, to test them out and do a review on it, and then to give feedback. I don't know if they're kind of doing, they want a little bit of feedback on it too, to uh, get some, some ways to improve on, or just for marketing purposes type thing. So installation of these, I didn't do an install video. If you want to see, if you would like to see these in how I installed these, let me know and I will do a separate video to kind of show you. I will say, being that this is a review and I disclose to them that, hey, I'm going to be 100% honest in this review, I will say this package did not come with any instructions. So if you are not mechanically inclined at all, you may need to figure out how to install them. It is pretty straightforward. If you know which, which wiring harness to disconnect because it, all right. So let's just go up in the grass up here, which is probably kind of weird, but So if you know which way to install, then it's not going to be an issue for you. Or if you know which, which harness is for the lights and whatnot. So you just disconnect, there's a little splitter, you connect that in, you reconnect the other piece to the main harness that goes up to the controls up here. And then there's the wires you got to run down and they have little disconnects so if you want to take your bags off you can disconnect i just zip tied them up to the fender there's some little spots to zip tie to and put a little dialect grease in there just to connect and seal everything and that was that was pretty much it i would say total install would be about an hour so let's get the tripod set back up here so there you got a pretty good view of how they look and I apologize at how much of an angle I'm at but you're gonna get the idea here so definitely nice and bright brightens the back of that bike up nice hit the brakes turn the indicator on turn the other indicator on I don't know, in my opinion, it it definitely 
add some brightness and hopefully a little bit of visibility. So yeah, you can see how they look without the light on. For a part that is less expensive than a lot of the competition, uh, there are some little little areas of concern. I'm hoping over time water does not get down inside this seam at all. It seems like there's a little bit of a space in here. But for a part that, you know, runs around that 50 bucks currently in 2022 uh, I would say they look nice they look a lot nicer than what I anticipated they are definitely bright and give them a try if you are interested TCMT Moto was generous enough to work with me on getting you all a discount code if you wanted to try them I will put that on the screen right now and anything you go and order and use this code, you will receive an 8% discount on your order. the hazards on and give you a good view of how they look. So let's take a little closer look here. So the cord, cord comes out right along here I put a couple clips down inside to hold everything and then the little disconnects there runs up under the side panel and connects with the modulator or the, the little piece for the LED conversion under the seat and then same on the other side here just runs runs down inside and there you have it all right, so I normally don't like to do review videos until I have had the product and tested it for a little while. But we had a nice night. Seemed like a good time to come out and kind of go through everything with you. I will come back in the future, give you a little bit more of an update, and let you know if I am still happy with the TCMT Moto Parts. I will also put a link in the description down below for what they are. You can find them on Amazon. Let me know in the comments down below what you think. If you think they are nice and bright, if you've been thinking about putting these lights on, kind of curious to know. Let me know if you have these lights and what your thoughts are. But as of right now, the day I installed them and I've tested them a little bit here now. I am pleased with what I have for the price that they would be retail. Like I said, I didn't pay anything for these lights. TCMT Moto was generous enough to supply the parts to me in exchange of putting them on and showing all of you and letting you know what my thoughts are on them. So I appreciate, appreciate it, TCMT Moto. Like I said, if you have any questions, leave it in the comments below. And if not, until next time, two old friends, I can't show you the, the light blinking back there. But until next time, ride safe, ride often, peace out, and we'll see you later. Bye-bye.